Howdy! Welcome to part 2 on the Christmas light controller build. This time I'm building the slave module. Uh, I know part 2 was supposed to be testing of the master module, but in preliminary testing, of which I have the video around somewhere, um, it wasn't happy. Uh, the only thing I could figure after much, much time trying to get it to work is that the pick chip was misprogrammed. Uh, I've ordered a replacement program pick chip. I don't have a programmer that can program a pick 33. I can do pick the uh, DS pick 33. Sorry, I can do DS pick 30, but not 33. Um, so while that is on its way, I'll do the assembly of the slave unit. So hopefully, uh, the new pick chip arrives and the master unit works, and I'll do the testing video. Then we'll hook it up and see how well it works. Anyway, it is time to get soldering. Okay, so my battery went flat just as I started. Uh, doing resistors and didn't know, so half the resistors are now done, so I'll continue soldering with the other half of the resistors.
there we go, LED slave. I'm um, testing this again, we'll have to wait until I've gotten the master unit working, but they're actually quite small, so there's the, oops, the master unit and the slave unit. So this has a Cat5 connector output which comes in here and controls it and hopefully it will look pretty good when it's all done, but I have to wait for the new pick chip, so once that arrives, I'll do the video on testing it, and hopefully all is well. Anyway, thanks for watching.